it's finally here. The Charizard that I sent off the grade about a month ago. And, and I might have mm, procrastinated just a little bit. Because, uh, you know, we're human. We forget some things. But in preparation for this Charizard, we are going to be opening up some Obsidian Flames packs that I have here in my hand. As well as some 151 booster ETB stuff right here because they both have Charizards in there. Now, I already have Charizard in Obsidian Flames, as you guys may already know. Uh, but we're going to start with that first because we are looking for an Absol EX. Uh, I have come, as you guys know, I have come back from StellarCon. It was amazing if here we go. What? Uh, I was about to say Water Energy, but it's dark. Smoliv, Weasel, we got Paldean Wooper, Phantom. Frogadier, Stunfisk, we have Slazzle, Reverse Hollow Surskit, Reverse Hollow Paldean, Clawsire, and the rare is Scovillain. Nothing new off there yet. Uh, it is almost time as well for the next set to come out, which is Paradox Rift. That is right. The introduction of the newest sort of, I guess, a battle style, I believe, since... That's, you know, I wouldn't call it like a future or an ancient style. It's a battle style. You know, you got your um, you got your single strike and your multi-strike, but you also have um, your ancient and your future kind of Pokemon. So those kind of Pokemon are being introduced now. I've seen some of the cards online through Poke Beach and other sites that have uh, been showing off the cards as well. Some of them look really playable, and some of them have really cool art. Uh, Dartrix, Reverse Hall Dartrix. Reverse Hall's had both and a Palafin. All right, uh, still nothing there. Uh, we are going to keep working on it though. Um, but yeah, so StellarCon was um, very fun. Um, I got to meet the voices of the Crystal Gems, uh, Scarlet, or uh, gosh, not Scarlet. Oh my gosh, I'm still acting like a fool even after uh, meeting the gems. Uh, Am Garnet, Amethyst, and Pearl. Um, all three wonderful people. They were so their personalities really kind of matched their characters uh, that they played. So we got steel energy here. Um, so like uh, Dietz or uh, Michaela Dietz was very hyper. She was very interactive with everyone. That's kind of like reason why her line was so long and nothing. We have a dog. Um, so that's kind of like the reason why her line was so long and everyone really wanted to meet her because she was more of a spunky personality. She showed, she showed more of herself, which is okay. All the gems are different in their own special way, and there's nothing wrong with showing off a little bit of their differences, which is perfectly all right. Now, ETB. Um, so, Link with, um, with uh, Dee Dee, uh, who voiced Pearl, um, she was a little more soft-spoken. She was almost like the mom figure. Um, she she was very soft-spoken she was like oh hello it's so nice to meet you she just she had that mom uh figure about her where um it's just kind of you know it was very like a warm feeling meeting her and there's the code card for the etb right there um it was a warm feeling meeting her just all the excitement and knowing that you know she's very nice very caring and considerate she was just she was so sweet and when I showed her, <laughs> I, I showed her the, um, the, the card, uh, the Diancy. She's like, oh, it's a, it's a Pokemon card. She really, like, announced, <laughs> announced the, um, the, the syllab, uh, the syllables in there. We have, uh, Primeape, Fero, Onyx. We have a Reverse Hollow Nidorino. Oh, it's a War Turtle Trainer Gallery. That's, that's the first hit of the day right there, folks. Absolutely Positively awesome right there. Now, <clears throat> do we have a two-for-one deal? Do we? Do we? And we don't. It's a Raichu. Card that I don't think I have yet, though. Electrical Grounding. Oh, one of your Pokemon's... To this Pokemon. Oh, that's cool. All right, we'll sleeve up the... Hello? You want to sleeve? I, like, tried to sleeve, and it just decided... Boop. Nope, not today. Gift, not today. All right, that's a new card right there in the bag. Um, but yeah, so Didi was like, you know, very like you know, the pronunciation. It's a Pokemon card. Like she was doing like her pearl voice. It was so, it was, it was absolutely insane being in their presence. And of course, you know, I brought Panic along. And if you guys follow my um, my Instagram, uh, Gift Takes Pictures, um, we also brought um, her brother, 
um, who's who I'm also getting into Pokemon right now, and I'm going to be taking to a pre-release for Paradox Rift. A lot of things going on right now. We got Magneton. Oh, I thought I saw something. Nido Queen. Uh, Reverse Hollow Eevee. Reverse Hollow Magnezo or Magneton, and a Ditto Hollow Graphic Ditto. Um, but yeah, so uh, I met we met Deets on the first day. Um, and she took a, <laughs> she took a video of us, and since, um, uh, my, my IRL name is, you know, Mickey, and she, she asked me my name, and I'm holding the card on, she said, wait, what's your name? And I go, it, it's Mickey, and she's like, oh, oh boy, and then I really gave her like a, oh boy, that one. Um, so <laughs> um, so it was very she was just oh my gosh like she was so into it she was so into like um making everyone happy that she came into contact with and we have a machamp there um everyone that left her table left with the, i think everyone left with a smile some of them left crying uh not because they were mean no not by any means just uh, the the show had a big has a big impact on everyone new and old it's a very it's a, it's a very emotional show and it's a very realistic show about our emotions and it's 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 amazing i would i would highly suggest you guys watch it and kind of playing on like um what ooh, fire energy hello maybe charizard in here uh we have magmar we have horsey abra diglett gold duck pinsir we have bills transfer Reverse Hollow Graveler. Oh, baby! We are just hitting the poles tonight. We've got the Trainer Gallery Special Edition Venusaur. Look at that boy go. And now, folks, do we have a second two for... Well, our first. Our, for, our second attempt at a two for one deal. Do we have it? Oh, the side really made me thought we had it. We have an Aerodactyl. That is uh, that is very chaotic background. But this this card right here, Legendary Venusaur, Tranquil Flowers. You can heal whatever active Pokemon it is. So if you can just keep healing Venusaur up, absolutely amazing. There you go. Hang out with War Turtle right there in the cool card club. There we go. Um, But a lot of people, like, it was... If I had to, like, take a guess at, like, who, like, I, like there's a couple things. Who they want to see most? Probably Deets. Who they probably, like, had a, you know, better time with? I, I really don't know. But everyone did a really good job. Um, and I wanted, I definitely want to say there was a lot of cool cosplays. I saw a lot of Pearl and Garnet cosplays. And some of them were, ooh, holographic energy. Look at all the, look at that big dot right there. Oh, yeah. Um, a lot of them were... Like a lot of Garnet cosplays, some of them were really, really good. I mean, like we've—I've never. This is my first time being to like an actual convention for like nerds and stuff like that. We have a Reverse Hollow Muck, Reverse Hollow Growlithe, and a Mewtwo. Um, my first time being to a convention like this, so um, it was very different. Um, it took like the first day for me to really like take everything in, but I was so ha 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 excited. Um. Who else was there? Roger Bumpus was there. We didn't get him inside the tentacle because I forgot to bring it. Um, but we did have uh, me, uh, me panic and uh, with Squidward, uh, Mr. Roger Bumpus, um, and Flip. Is that another one? Oh no, it's not. Um, but he was he was a very laid back guy, very chill. Like you could tell he's done that for a long time. Roger is seventy one. I did not know that he was that old until um, Panic looked him up online. And, hey, holographic air does. Nice. Um, and when she told me, I'm like, there's no way he's 71. And I thought, because I saw, like, you know, like, we've seen headshots of him. And I saw him, like, on, you know, the the advertisement, like, online for StellarCon. I think to myself, the guy has to be, like, maybe, maybe in his early 60s. And if it's a high possibility, maybe in, like, his late 50s. Dude's 71. He has the beard of a 71-year-old, but he's got the the swagger and the movement of a, a, a mid-50-year-old man. He's done well for himself. We've got Magneton, Reverse Hollow Grabber, Reverse Hollow Tangula, and a Dodrio. All right, two packs left. I think we can get something out of this. There is potentiality, absolutely. Um, but he was, he was a cool dude. He was very chill. You can tell he's done it for a long time. Um, and I was just, it was very, very, very happy times 
to see um, Mr. Roger. It was very, very cool. All right, uh, Grass Energy. Ooh, yay, maybe another Venusaur. What if we get a God Pack out of this? <gasps> God Pack, God Pack. I smell something. Charmander, muck. We have Daisy's help. Venomoth, nope, no God Pack. Reverse Hall Sandshrew, <laughs> Reverse Hall Metapod. And a regular Arbok EX spitting out some Venom. Ding, ding, dang. Ding, 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 dang. All right, and we are going to put you in the sleeve. Another card we don't have. We have the full art. We don't have the regular. There we go. All right, so I put the first pack magic on the bottom, so that way we know it's last. Here it is. And we are going to open this up here. Um, but Estelle was, like again, they're all, all the gems were very much like in character as well. It was really cool. Um, and I got them all to sign to Diancy, which was really cool. Estelle was very calm, very mild-mannered. Um, very polite. Uh, water energy? Another grass energy. Okay. Um, so she was very much like, um, in it, in character as well. Like I will say, um, big air balloon, reverse hall Persian, reverse hall Grimer. And the last is a Flareon. We don't have a Flareon though, which is okay. I'll take a Flareon that we don't have. Thank you very much. Now, without further ado, we are going to open up the the box that contains a Charizard, supposedly. All right, Latios, you've helped me out before. Give me some good luck again. So, oh, look, oh, PSA. Okay, so it is, oh, wow. It is covered in a thick amount of bubble wrap. I can see it somewhere in there. You're gonna go down there, buddy. Okay, gently now. I'm trying not to look, I'm trying. Oh, wait, okay. I think I see, the, okay, all right, okay, there we go, I have it on the back, okay, I see the back of it, bubble wrap, you're gonna go in the trash, I'm gonna play with it later, so, uh, has all the information here, okay, so, I'm gonna swing it around here, there it is, PSA, you guys can see my camera, all right, we're hoping for a seven, on the count of three, ready, one, two, three, is unfortunate no why what gave it a four it looks great the front looks immaculate is it the back Ooh. oh 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 uh, yeah there is a so i don't know if you guys can kind of like tell on the back here so if the camera focuses oh no you had it buddy focus no stay focused you had it i'm gonna go back a little bit wait no buddy 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 there it is. Okay, so you can kind of see like the little, the the ridges down here, like you can see it kind of going. Plot. I'm guessing that's what they really merited on right there. But, I mean, hey, Charizard's a Charizard. I'll take it. It's a base set. It's something. And with that, on a great note here today, thank you guys very much for watching. Uh, hopefully, I find another Charizard in long future, in the ever yearning future. And hey, I'm happy with the cards we got today. Venusaur, War Turtle, and Arbok. Gonna go right into Binder. So, if you guys had a great time today, make sure, leave a like, hit subscribe, and I will see you guys later.